Alex started, started working here as a stagiaire, like uh, from his school. He was going to adult school. Um, for employment, it was not always easy to find. And he was very quiet in the beginning and everybody's saying that he's opening up, and which is really neat with Sun Youth. It's inclusive. They accept him. When he talks, he's listened to. So he partakes, he feels like it's a big family to him. And me as a parent, it's, I, I, I'm proud of him and I feel, um, you know when your kid gets accepted, it's, it's something. I am belong 14, soon uh, 15 uh, years, I'm here. I've always wanted to be involved with Sun Youth ever since I've been a teenager, but didn't have time to do it. So I've been doing about maybe almost five years. And sometimes people come and they, they're dire straits and it's like, it, it's overwhelming sometimes. And it's, I feel that I'm contributing in my little modest way. There was a little lady that came from Ukraine. She was just coming off from the airport. She had nothing. We gave her as best as we could because she was staying in a hotel room. And then her again, she started crying. Thank you, thank you. And I said, the only thing I know how to say in Ukrainian is yapka. And I, she gave me a big hug and away we went. I mean, there's a lot of situations and I wish people would um, be more open to donate because it's really a good organization from the bottom to the top. Sometimes it's one drop, like I said, one drop, you fill up a, a bucket and it could put out a fire. And well, it could put out hungry bellies. All the toys for the toys for the children.